let's go over how you could change the color of an image using Affinity Designer. The first step is to open up your image and then come over here to the Layers menu and select your image. If you have a lock applied to your layer, click on that icon to get rid of it. Now we're going to apply an adjustment layer, so come down here to this half circle icon and click on that. And from this list we are going to choose HSL. Within the HSL menu, you will see a list of colors here. If you select one of these colors, you can change that particular color in the image. So in my example here, I have this yellow shoe. If I want to change this yellow color to something else, I could just select the shade yellow over here, and I can use the hue slider to change the color, as you can see there. Now the problem with using these colors over here is that they don't always represent the exact color range you want to change. So for example, in my image here, my image is yellow-ish, but it's not entirely yellow. So let's say I wanted to change this entire range of colors for this particular shade right here. This is where the picker option comes in handy. So click on the picker box, and then come over here and click on any area of the image to select a range of colors. And now you can get a more accurate color correction, as you can see there. So I'm gonna change this to something else. I'm gonna go with a red shade. And if you come down here to the saturation shift, you can increase the saturation. Uh, but if you can see there, if you increase it too much, it starts to grab other nearby colors, which you don't want. And then you could bring it down as well. If you bring it down too much, it removes the color altogether. So if you bring it down here towards the end, and then take the luminosity shift, this is the brightness and the darkness. You can make it darker for like a, a deeper burgundy color like that. And then you can come back over here and adjust the saturation as needed. Or you can move the luminosity shift upwards to get a brighter shade like that. So I'm going to bring this down about that far, and I'll bring that down to about here. And if you want to change the color again, just come back up here to the hue slider, and you can see how this looks in all of these different colors here, as you can see like that. And once you're finished, you can close out of the menu. And there you go. That is how you could change the color of an object using Affinity Designer. Join the Logos by Nick mailing list and get over 200 free design templates, including logos, avatars, textures, infographics, and more. As a member, you'll receive news, updates, and tips about your favorite design apps. Just use the link below to subscribe for free and download your templates. As always, thanks for watching.